A little update for you. I've just cleaned out my flights as best as I can. And I've put all the green finches together in the big flight because I think obviously they need a bit more room than the reds. So what I've done now, I've put in the bottom flight, um, the reds and the A-gates, obviously that I know are cocks. So there's one or two young youngsters in there that I know are cocks because they've sang already. So I've, I've started separating them off, put them in, in the bottom flight. Um, so there, there is a, there's a bit too many at the moment in this top flight, but as the weeks go by, they will thin out. Cause I think, um, uh, that first round, um, intensive cock, not bad color on him now, to be honest, that, as he's, uh, nearly finished, it's not as bad as what I thought they were, but they're quite nice birds to be fair. Um, yeah, I think that's possibly a cock as well, but I think I said before, it's, a, it's not amazing. There's a bit of frosting on it, which is obviously what you don't want on an intensive bird. Um, yeah, so yeah, a few too many in there at the moment, but gradually they'll even out and I'll, uh, <clears throat> by Christmas time, I'll probably have I'm all separated. Then I can choose which ones I want to keep and which ones are going to go. Um, still got my little five crosses, what I used for feeders. One of them that didn't do a good job he is that one down there. It's like a buff, buff looking bird. That's how I'll re remember. And this intensive looking bird was obviously the better one. So I'll keep that one as a feeder. Um, yeah, as you can see, there's color coming through on it. So I think the chap did say they were um, Red Factor Fife Crosses, make good feeders. So yeah, I'll keep that one. They're coloring up quite nice to be fair. Um, yeah, so that's all I got to report at the moment. Um, yeah, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with the, um, with the greenies. Oh, I'm still on the fence with them. Um, don't know if they're really for me. Um, nice birds. Don't really sing all that well, as you probably all well know. Um, I do like singing birds. But then I did also say... I had a bit of a guts full of goldfinches because they just die so easy, but I don't know. I'm just drawn to them for some reason. Whether I'll get some more, I just don't know. I'm toying with the fact, do I get some red poles? They're nice little birds. I don't think they're very good singers, but I don't know. Quite fancy some red siskins if I can get some of them. Um, yeah, it probably seems a bit silly to keep, um, like, birds like green finches that are not um, red in color obviously red poles and stuff like that are better if you're keeping red ground birds um, you're probably better off going just like red but I'm not too sure we'll see I'm definitely gonna try some mules next year so whether I get some more goldies in or some red siskins or something like that. We'll see, but definitely gonna have a good crack at um, some uh, mules next year. Obviously a lot of these I've got to go because I'll probably only keep a pair or two, like, two pairs may maybe. So a lot of them got to go anyway. Um, I put the cocks in with the hens. Um, I don't think there's gonna be any squabbling now. Obviously as they're near on finished molting um yeah I, I, I thought most of the young were all hens but there's some showing quite a lot of color on them so yeah i'm not too sure um 
obviously the, the definite cock. I think is that one at the back there. Sulking a bit. Obviously they've just been moved into here. Yeah, that's the definite cock. Nice, a bit more color on that one. So, but there's one or two of these um, youngsters that have got a nice bit of color on. So we'll see. Um, it is a bit hard to tell with the Lutines, but it'll sort itself out. Even if I was to keep these until sort of next spring, like you'll probably start to see squabbling or maybe birds feeding each other and stuff like that. So I'll be able to work out at some point. A um, bit easier with the, with the normals, you can tell quite easy. Yeah, so just a little update for you. Like I said, nothing too much to to tell you really, but yeah, birds are coloring up quite nice to be fair. I'm really pleased. I'll probably do another video when they're all colored up and I got them sorted which ones I'm going to keep and which ones is going to go. So that's it for now.